Ready. All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. McGregor gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. He's got to shore up the defense here, though. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Oh, nice left hand there by Conor McGregor. He's still got it. Yeah, he absolutely has it. He's one of those guys that understands distance management better than most fighters. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Conor McGregor. Big kick lands. Conor McGregor gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. All right, he engages in the single power tie. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Oh, misses with the jab. Oh! Just missed with the left there. Ball lands the double jab. Those are going to start to take their effect. What a punch. Oh, spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Gamebred. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, missed on that one. Round one winding down here. Lands flush with that right hand. Oh. All right, here we go with our second round now. Conor McGregor and Jorge Gamebred must be done. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh! Oh, he's the best strike he's thrown tonight! The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive upset. He's a you ready to fight? Ready. All right, so here we go with round one. Classic matchup of striker versus striker. These guys have both faced a lot of grapplers in the past. They like the draw tonight. Oh, yeah, they love seeing an opponent that will not be trying to dive at their legs. They know when they get to the center of the octagon, the only steps back they will take is if they choose to move out of range to re-enter back into the striking realm. It's a very comforting thought for both of these competitors. I mean, you know it's coming, but because Connor does such a great job of managing space, he's so quick, he's so active, you don't know when he's going to throw that punch. Back and forth we go. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Single collar tie now. Left hand punch. Oh, 
Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. So just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Conor McGregor. Big punch land. Boom. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh, beating his leg up. And now Masvidal's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Good punch lands. for him thus far tonight. Oh, just missed on the overhand left. That might have done some damage. Hey, where is he lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh! Oh, big left. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing oh, everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Oh, that's a big connection there for McGregor, DC. I mean, big strike landed for Ireland's favorite son, Conor McGregor. Beautiful strike. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. 66 total strikes have now landed for Conor McGregor. And connecting at a 44% clip tonight, DC, against Jorge Masvidal. McGregor gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his strike. Oh! Look at that. Oh, the it's over. It's over. It's over. Oh, my goodness. What a fight. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched one. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 2 minutes, 41 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Conor McGregor. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout.